Hi and welcome back to Tier 10 to Prem with Mausel AFC. Today it's back to the Premier League and hopefully start picking up some more points. We've picked up points. We have. Should we go and have a look, shall we? But please do, before we go any further, don't forget, let's get those things up above us going. Get subscribing, get liking and all that jazz. <laughs> Yes, we picked up a couple of points. We're still 18th in the league. Not doing very well. It's not a great season so far. But we went to Old Trafford and we only went and drew one all. And as we can see, the defence had a blinder. Midfield was a bit shocking. But um, we did well. We did rather well. Drew one all. Toby Young's with the goal. We then had the uh, third round of the Carabao Cup. Won that 3-0. Matthew Roberts, two goals. And El Tino with the other goal. Unfortunately, Josh Sainsbury got injured. It's out for five weeks. <sighs> Bit of a blow, but we'll see. We then went to Norwich. Away from home again. And Luca popped up with a goal in the first minute and again looking at the ratings of defenders look and and McLeod backs against the wall it really was 45th minute goal for them but yes so today we've changed it up ever so slightly he says massively <laughs> I wasn't very happy and uh yeah, we picked up points, but we weren't in the games. We weren't in the games. So, trying something slightly different today. We've got so many great strikers. So, that's what we're going to do. We're going to go with a load of quality, quality strikers. In fact, Luca, what's Luca's best? It's a deep line or complete. So, I think if we go complete, is that his best... No, it's probably a deep line, isn't it? Deep line on support. That'll probably give him his full stars. Yes, there we go. Right, so what we're going to do, slight tweak, big tweak to the, to the team. And because we've got so many great strikers and great midfielders, that's what we're going to go with. We're going to narrow the play, get the wing backs up, Complete wing backs as well now, and we'll see what happens. McLeod in goal, back four, Sainsbury, Menendez, Maxwell, Youngs, Rodrigo at the base, El Tino, and Powell in the middle. Then our front three of Irwin, Luca, and Roberts. What could possibly go wrong? Let's get on and have a look, shall we? And the teams are in, and off we go. Come on, lads. Show me you can do more. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Right, boys. We will start off balanced as well. Just a little bit different. Different formation. Hopefully, we'll scare the bejesus out of teams. Seeing that front three. Roberts, Luca, Irwin. What a team this could be. Cross everything, please, for me. Come on. And Gilmore swings it in, and it's wide. Right, shout of encourage. Come on, boys. McLeod's frustrated, but everyone else is fine. Sainsbury. Now, there's meant to be three people up there. Where are you all? The only one there is Irwin. There's Luca. Where the hell's Roberts? There's Luca. There's Roberts. We're three on two. Roberts! Roberts! Matthew Roberts! Get in there, boys! Oh my word. 
15 minutes gone. Now look at that, we're three on two. This could be the tactic. Forget your four two fours and your four three two ones. Not interested in offsides, get on with it. This could be the way forward for a football manager. Oh my word. It's been quite a while actually, it was years ago I did do this on Football Manager FM12? I think I did this formation. And I was I was at work today and I thought, can I try something different? I've got so many great strikers. And it was in Football Manager 12. And we had an awesome team, but we didn't couldn't get any wide players. There was just no wide players available. And every player we signed, we seemed to sign a striker. And I was like thinking, we got five great strikers. And lo and behold, we've probably got five great strikers now. Young swings it in. Come on. Rodrigo. Don't dive in like that, son. Oh, Maxwell, you superstar. What a challenge. Now, this is the only problem. is wide. It's all up to Sainsbury. Oof, the game is buffering and beating around it. No, we're not going to do anything there, but we will go positive his last five minutes. He says, McLeod knocks it away. It's the first time I've seen McLeod come out and actually flap around at a ball. Now, we've had six chances to their 11 and the XGs are the same. I'm sort of half happy. I'm half happy. All right, back to a balanced mentality for the start of the half. Um, we play well, but there's room for improvement. Well said, Jake Ash. I'm happy with that, son. Now, Young's obviously he's playing slightly. I was almost thinking playing fullback as on attack in his preferred position just on that side because teams do don't they? they don't they don't have a regimental straight down each way Altino so Powell Powell is probably the one who's playing a little bit out of position so what we'll do with him we will go to his full back on attack drop him back slightly Powell Yestin Powell 6.6 .6. Boracea come in there. Altino, Sainsbury, he's on a 6.8. That's the thing, everybody's playing well. I don't really want to do too much. Half an hour gone, half an hour to go. Irwin's playing a lot better. That's a lot better for Merwin. Young's to Boracea. Boracea's been scythed down. I don't know why he's gone for. VAR is nowhere near the penalty box. Really? If he gives this as a penalty, I will be absolutely stunned. What even close? Right, Rodrigo. Who have we got that can come in? And take Rodrigo off. Rodrigo. Ooh. McLelland, we haven't seen him for a little while. And then we will go with Altino as well off for Ryman. And we're balanced already. We don't want to do anything else there, to be honest. Ryman playing as a box to box. Boracea as that deep line. 1 0 will do. I was going to say, do we do a focus? McLeod, Menendez to Sainsbury, Ryman coming forward, box to box midfielder, three to choose, Luca against the legs. But with that front three looking awesome, focus. Everyone was pleased until that moment. Come on, boys. 
positive mentality last five minutes just up our up our roles they're playing with two Mazalas in there they've gone to a free at the back it's four minutes of added on time and it's Young's to swing it in oh Luca over the bar was it Menendez in the end both of them in there and could this be a tactical masterstroke oh my days but I do think nice win well done we do need to find a defensive midfielder could that be lucky mouse will celebrate unlikely victory the Mark Goldsworthy Stadium sees its first win okay so for today's game we have slightly changed things a little bit um, just just trying little bits you know it's it's a new tactic I'm even thinking about playing with the diamond it's got potential possibilities we'll wait and see but McLeod in goal today we've switched Maxwell around to the right hand side because he is predominantly a right back or he's never going to be a right back he's six foot seven but right sided player so we brought him this side so Sainsbury Maxwell Rodrigo Youngs so Rodrigo comes in as a centre back on cover so something better than what Menendez can do Enzo at the base Eltino and Boracea Erwin Roberts and Luca so we've actually got that so one two three four five Brazilians starting in this game mental so the teams are in for the Prescott Derby pick up from where you left off last time we've had a couple of friendlies in between again massive break between this game two weeks international break so uh, plenty of goals scored in those friendlies and uh, confidence hopefully is riding high you don't see that very often everybody on a 6.7 seven minutes into the game interesting right drop back to a balanced mentality for a minute this is being away from home i'm wondering whether this is just a little bit too attacking whether we should have a diamond i don't know it's, it's toying with those little bits and pieces at the moment a bit of encouragement after 15 minutes we've not had a shot that's not good we need the ball boys come on and it's Watford with the first highlight and they're pinging it around ball swung in there's no one there come on we should be getting that away and it's swung back in again Sainsbury away with it this time so there's Luca. Luca's dropped in with two up top so come on boys this is a long highlight this is a long highlight how many more times is it going to carry on oh 20 minutes gone 1-0 down because it was so long you knew there was a goal coming and uh, unfortunately not our way fire up come on boys Sainsbury seems to be pressurised and Erwin's nervous I'm wondering Erwin Erwin do we need to bring Erwin out of the firing line and drop into a diamond mm, it's got uh, it's got potential it's got potential Rodrigo away with it Boracea Boracea to Erwin right Erwin what can you do Irwin forward to Luca. What a goal! What a strike that is! If you've seen a goal of the season contender so far, that has got to be nailed on, isn't it? Irwin out wide, crosses it over. Luca, oh, what a pleasure! What a pleasure to see that goal! Oh my word! Now, see, with Erwin, he's only got 12 vision. I was wondering whether his vision was better. But what a strike that was. Let's get it away. Borrow chair away. Roberts picks it up. Out to Luca. 
Irwin's offside. Did he see that? Boracea, Enzo, Eltinio, Youngs, Boracea, Irwin. Oh my word. He's gone and scored. I was just saying about taking him out the firing line. And we're 2-1 up. Quick fire double. What I am wondering as well, Boracea and Enzo are getting in each other's places. So that, whether Enzo needs to change his role slightly, are they? They are quite close, aren't they? They are quite close. If he's under his feet like that, that's not what we need. Um, bit of praise for half time. Everybody's pleased, everybody's happy. Two on up half time. Bring my face back up. Enzo on a 6.5. Happy with the performance so far. Keep it up. Right, I'll tell you what we will do. We will change Enzo's roll. Mm. Should he be on support? No, no. I tell you what. Forget that. I didn't. Say, I, I didn't say anything. Eltinio, Boracea, Eltino, Boracea, Sainsbury, Sainsbury, Luca at the far post. Miss with a free header. It's a free header, boys. Come on. The balance mentality maybe is what's helping. I'm not sure. Sainsbury. He is looking shot out there. If he comes on. Oh, what a save. Oh, he saved that, didn't he? Well, okay, we'll, uh, we'll go with that. Enzo. Mm. Yes. Roberts is the worst one out there at the strikers. Eltinio, Enzo. Right, we will now go in. And we will drop into a diamond. And Yestin Powell can come on there. And what would he rather be? Oh, he can be any of them. Advanced midfielder, that'll do. Or advanced playmaker? Yeah, advanced playmaker. In fact, what does he say he wants to be? Advanced playmaker on support. That's sorted that one. Eltinio and Enzo switch. Enzo, off you come, son. For Ryman. And he can be that box to box midfielder. Right. Let's go out there. Let's kill this game off, boys. Come on. 2 1 up. We've taken off the players that were having the weaker games. Maxwell 6.5. I don't want to drop back to a defensive mentality. That's just too much. Whether we go positive for 10 minutes. Because we have brought our XG right up. We're 1.1, they're 1.95. But we have we have had a bit better XG these last few minutes. 12 to go. There's not a lot going on. But this will take us up to 13th place. And then, look at that. We really have got a possibility. Right, back to a balanced, balanced mentality. Luca and all, look at that. Luca, Irwin. Wow. He was talking about taking Irwin out of the firing line. He's on a 7.7. .7. Absolutely stunning. Two minutes to go. Can we see this through for another victory? Oh, my word. Whether the dropping back into the diamond did it, I don't know. But um, that was really special. Magnificent. Congratulations. Give yourselves a pat on the back, boys. Well done. Oh, my word. Right, schedule. I think we'll be back. Oh, look at this run. We've got a horrendous run of games coming up. But do we want to see those games? 
Man City and Burnley, I think. We'll come back for Man City and Burnley. Well, if you've enjoyed that, everybody, which I hope you have, because that may be the turning point in our season with a bit of a tactical masterclass. But please do come back for episode 152 in Tier 10 to Prem with Mausel AFC. I am James. This is the Presec Channel. Thanks for watching.